Don in London, hello. September the 23rd. My video is all about recovery from addiction to either substance or behaviour. My addictive substance, alcohol, my behaviour, equally addictive to people, places and things. Namely, work, relationships, collecting, trying to feel right, trying to be perfect and never so. Fearful, putting on a brave face and a very brittle ego with nothing underneath it very in fact no self-esteem most of the time if you ask me what self-esteem was I thought ego was self-esteem these days just making progress one day at a time in sobriety and joining the days up as I go so living in sobriety I feel able to be open honest and willing to change let the world in learn the truth of now that's my spiritual connection to living and I share here the daily reflections from this book from AA, Alcoholics Anonymous, fellowship which I'm very pleased to be a part of. I don't speak for AA, never can, never will. It's full of unique, authentic people who may share their experience, strength and hope where they will. And uh, I share the daily reflections. And for September the 23rd, it says, I was an exception. He, Bill, he, Bill W., that's the, one of the co-founders, said to me, gently and simply, do you think that you were one of us? That's an alcoholic. During my drinking life, I was convinced I was an exception. I thought I was beyond petty requirements and had the right to be excused. I never realized that the dark counterbalance of my attitude was the constant feeling that I did not belong. At first in AA, Alcoholics Anonymous, I identified with others only as an alcoholic. What a wonderful awakening for me it was it has been to realize that if human beings were doing the best they could then so was I all of the pains confusions and joys they feel are not exceptional but part of my life just as much as anybody's so in other words all the pains confusions and joys that we all feel are not exceptional it's part of everybody's life and that's why we can be a part of what is going on included to love, be loved and useful. So when I'm feeling out of balance and I'm trying to find a little bit of serenity in a dark day or even when the day is very bright and joyful, balance can be hard to find. So the serenity prayer to acceptance helps me. So to God if you understand or simply to good conscience, grant me the serenity to accept the things I cannot change courage to change the things I can and the wisdom to know the difference for me is always just for today